Boom, welcome back to the channel. I'm Hank Strange. This is Stranger Palooza. That is Nick Schmidt. How are you, Sunshine Hank? State RB. What's up? Good to see you, sir. Yes, man. This is when I like to make videos, when it's nice, nice. and cool. What are we, 70 something maybe? I think we're under 70 we're today. Under 70? High, yeah, the high nice. was like 68 today. <laughs> Perfect. This is this is a sunshine state, but it's not yeah. very sunny today. This is how we need to do it all the time. Yes. All right. Yes. But we have a follow up of sorts. We do. To one of the videos that we put out where we were both whispering and people found that extremely amusing. <laughs> it was a very top secret video that, that we just did. Looking at that, I was like, this is so stupid. What? Why we're, were we whispering? We're whispering, yes. but yes. yes. So this was in that video where we're talking about the, um, the Sprinter, the Sprinter Echo. Echo and all the new yeah. stuff Winnebago's yeah. coming out with. Right. We, we previewed the Winnebago Solus Pocket. They call it very. 36B. I don't yeah. know what the 36 stands for. Yeah. The B maybe yeah. is the second version, right? But we previewed it, we showed some of the highlights. Now we just got our first one in yesterday, yeah. And now me and Hank and all 12 of you guys that watch this video <laughs> are gonna go uh, through it we're together. Over 40,000 subscribers, oh, 40,000. Just, just, just all think of us about are that, gonna yeah. go through Look this. Look at how cute it is. Look. Look at all, that. Dude. All of us are going to go through tiny. this together and we're going to learn <laughs> yes. about the new Solus Pocket. Yeah. I just call it the Pocket B. I mean, okay, I, I don't, Pocket B. Pocket B. 2024. 2024. Brand new hotness. New chassis. Ceramic new gray or something like this that. This thing's 17 feet long. Wow, 17 My feet long. My wife's SUV is 18 feet. Right. I mean, this is smaller than an SUV. Size matters, but in reverse. We're gonna give you guys all the details of this probably before very many folks out there have seen it, right? First one out? Yeah, let's get all into it right now. Boom. So as you guys might have already heard, Lola and myself are brand ambassadors for Sunshine State RV. And as Vanasaurs, I wanna take this moment to encourage anyone who is in the market for a Class B van to start their journey with SSRV. Sunshine State RVs specializes in selling Class B vans and B plus RVs. That is the reason why they are the number one dealer in all of the state of Florida. Number three in the whole United States. SSRV will fly you right to their location in Gainesville, Florida. They'll give you a very detailed and thorough walkthrough of your van, and they'll give you a two night stay at a local campground so you can get used to your van. If you don't like that, you can actually have hands-free delivery anywhere in the United States of your RV. We bought our Coachman Beyond from Sunshine State RV two years ago. And over the past two years, we've seen how they treat customers when it comes to warranty side. Their service team is great. Whether you bought it from them or not, every person that comes in there gets the same service and care when it comes to warranty repairs. The same service, attention, and care. And their team does a great job getting you back on the road safely. So if you guys are in the market for a B or B plus van, consider Sunshine State RV. We've got a link in the description that you guys can use to see their current inventory and have someone get in touch with you. All right, Nicholas. Yes, sir. Hank a doodle do. <laughs> so, well, did you just say Hank a doodle do? Hank a doodle do. <laughs> oh, you've been saving that one. I could tell. All right. <laughs> um, no, actually, my daughter's volleyball coach is named Hank, and, oh. <laughs> and so they call him Hanky. Oh, okay, yeah. Hank a doodle do. So there's a few. There's, yeah. there's, there's yeah. a few. Uh, okay, so. Sunshine State RVs mm -hmm. just got in the 2024 Winnebago Solus. So Solus is a great line, right? Yeah. It came out about two or three years ago, and they started making the 59P. Mm -hmm. Then they went to the 59PX. Right. Then they did no pop top or pop top. And then mm -hmm. now they did the Pocket 36A, which is a 17-footer. They just released the newest Pocket, which is mm -hmm. a 36B, which is 17 feet, but now this mm -hmm. has a ton, a ton of stuff in it. So it has a full shower. It has a toilet. Yeah. It has lithium It has batteries. everything you need. It has a sink in the bathroom. It yeah. has a kitchen sink. Yep. It has everything you need. A rooftop air conditioner. Yep. It has a It's complete a and it's short. And it's 17 feet. So uh, like I usually ask you, who's this for? Someone that wants to put it in their pocket. <laughs> no, this is for, I would say a single, there are four seat belts in it, mm -hmm. but this is for a single person that can full time. You know, Road Trek used to make one called the uh, uh, Axion, Corrado mm -hmm. Axion, A-X-I-O-N on this mm -hmm. chassis. And mm -hmm. we sold the heck out of them because they're yeah. 17 foot long with lithium and everything else. And that's the same thing this is. 
So this to me is a single person. Mm -hmm. This is somebody with a kid or two that 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 isn't going to sleep in it a lot, but mm -hmm. is going to drive around because there are four seat belts. Yeah. Um, or a person and their dog. Correct. You know, when I say single, single person, person, single yeah. person, their dog. Yeah. Maybe a husband and wife. Yeah. Or, you know, mm -hmm. a couple. Yeah. Um, but it's very small. Mm -hmm. And that's the point. I mean, yeah. literally, my wife drives a big SUV. We have right. four children. It's 18 feet, three inches. This is 17 feet, 10 inches. So for a 17-foot van to have all of that in it is insane. Yeah. Absolutely insane. If you're, if you're worried about the size of vans, which aren't very big either, but they're definitely bigger than this. So you want something small yes. to start with. Yes. Lots of maneuverability. If you yes. live in a city or you think you're going to be in a city and space is going to be a thing. This is awesome. This yeah. is really cool. I, so I like the color too. This is this is what they call ceramic gray. Ceramic gray. Okay. Um, really like the color. I like how tough it looks. I like how this is blacked out. Yep. That's to me. nice. I like how it's not shiny. Yeah. Um, I would have liked Winnebago to black this to black out. black the, the uh, Winnebago they, badges that are all over it out would be cool. They yeah. do offer that. Yeah. Um, but you could also do it too. There's some uh, spray on stuff that you could do. It's like a spray on vinyl. Like it's called, it's called dip your car. You can spray it on and peel it off. Wow. So if you, if you wanted to, you can, you know, Nick personally will do that for you. Uh, you can <laughs> Make promises. Good, good luck to you. Um, <laughs> if Nick so, does that for you, it's not so going to look go. that good. So okay. look at the size of this thing. So six yeah. foot tall. Yeah. I mean, this is this is a. I mean, this is a small RV. Yeah. It's so outside, cute. It looks, and you know, yeah. What a lot of people do is they end up taking this off, so that way it just, you know, funny you enough, can't we see. <laughs> uh, we sold one of the Axions, the seventeen footers, to mm -hmm. a guy, and what he did was he he put a sign here that mm -hmm. said uh, American Locksmith. Okay. And he put no Real phone stealth. number, Real no stealth. phone number, right. no email address, no website. Yeah. He said locksmith. Yeah. And you know, so that way he can park it everywhere and nobody yeah. would ever think it's an RV. You know what I would do? Because people might decide they want to get your locks. I would put poop removal. What do you think about that? What, sewage? <laughs> yeah, sewer removal. <laughs> no toxic, phone number, no toxic email waste. Address, no. <laughs> But no, I get it. I've seen people doing that. the only thing that's really going to tell from out here. Obviously, if you know about RVs, is this yeah. stuff, yes. and then the AC that's up there. So, Correct. Yeah. so I like the black wheels. I think that's uh -huh. a sharp look. Um, yep. This does have a 30 amp service. When you are plugged in, this does light up right here, so that way you know that you are getting power, which is really nice. Yeah, that's cool. Um, and then you have. I think Obviously. that's something I only see like on the Winnebago's, right? Yeah, so they use yeah. their own, they use a different yeah. uh, thing. You know, Coachman cool. uses the the smart plug. Yes. Winnebago uses this version of it. You put yeah. it in, you screw it in, and that way you know you have power. It is real mm -hmm. important to know you have power to, you know, to actually mm -hmm. not be arcing and causing yeah. a fire. Yeah. Um, there yeah. is a propane tank on board, and it is a oh. removable propane. It is yeah, not. We'll see. Can we see? Oh, there we go. It is not a uh, built-in. So this is just a port if you're going to put like a grill Correct. or something here. Correct. Okay. If you're going to put a put a grill here yeah. or something, you can just you know use this right here. Yeah. And you can oh, that's cool. you can grill right here. Yeah. Um, what's nice is some people just don't like propane at all. Yeah. If you don't, just remove that and you have extra storage. Yeah. If you're going to use the propane, it's 20 bucks at a gas station, $25. Swap yeah. that out for a new one. Yeah. And you don't have to go find a place to fill the propane. Yeah. So I've seen that pros, great propane debate going on. There are pros and cons to all of it. <laughs> yes. Yeah. So the pocket does have a gray tank. Okay. Um, and it has a cassette toilet. So this is where you dump your so gray tank. So that's your tank. gray. Okay. Right there. And then obviously you wouldn't have a black because... You have a cassette toilet. Yes. Uh, should we open this or should we make them wait? Oh, uh, we can open it since we're back here. So we can open it. Oh, this is go. very. This is actually pretty cool in something cool. this tiny. This is a rear bath, so yeah. people really like the rear bath, namely people named Hank Strange. Yes, I am um, a fan. Hank is a fan of the rear bath. He has the rear yeah. bath Coachman Beyond on yes. a transit chassis. Yeah. Yeah. Um, this is a rear bath. Yep. It has a lot of the same features. It is kind of flipped from yours though. So this is the sink is yeah, over the here. Sink. Yeah with a mirror and a wardrobe and a medicine cabinet there, there. A little there's shelf. a little there's a little power there's yeah, power cord that's cool you know power outlets yeah. right there you have your water you yeah. have a nice handle here to get in yeah. and out and people like having another sink in here because yeah. people don't want to use the same sink as in the bathroom but saying, this is 17 foot and yeah. you have two sinks yeah, you know, I mean, it's amazing. You have, also. This is your New York apartment studio apartments don't 100%. have two sinks. so this is yeah. your outside shower so yep. if you have a dog you would clean your dog, you can clean your feet, yep. but this is also 
Is this the shower head? This is the shower head. <laughs> okay, hold on. Hang it right here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Check that bad boy out. Oh, boy. <laughs> nice. Kind of shower. Yeah, the utilitarian. That's cool. And yeah. there's a vent in here, too, I see. Right there is. There's right a vent. Here. There's a shower yeah. curtain thing. Yeah. So, so you all can this. that all the way around. So you kind of got to move some yeah. stuff. Is like, there storage right there in that cabinet? There is. I'm about oh, to show cool. you. Look at that. Oh, so, so there's, there's storage, storage there, and then there's storage right here, too. So this is a big change from, so, yeah, from yeah. the pocket A that none of this was here. So this yeah, is a, a nice potential wardrobe. Yeah. There, and there's 110 plugs in there. Oh, sweet. And there's 12 volt in there. Let's see. All right. Can you see that? Yeah, I do. I see it. Okay, I was gonna show you. Yeah, so nice. you got so you got you know 110, you got 12 volt. You also have a port, that little black circle thing uh -huh. right there. That oh. is a port going up to the ceiling. That's cool. So if What's you that? add anything up on the roof, you don't have to cut holes. True statement. So you yes. got little cubby holes here. Thinking ahead, thinking ahead. Four like cubby that. holes here. Yep. You got a cabinet here. You can move those shelves. You got this storage here. This is big here. right here too. Yeah. Nice. My, I mean, my whole arm fits yeah. in there. That's for all the toilet paper. You have another one there. Uh, oh yeah, more. This is just empty storage. That's we, cool. you know, we give you free toilet paper when you buy an RV from Sunshine State yeah. RVs. Oh, nice. During nice. the pandemic, people so, were people were buying RVs just to get free toilet paper. Right. So I could just come in and get free toilet paper. When you why buy, am I going to Walmart to get when, my toilet paper? When you buy an to get RV, my RV, not a special RV toilet not paper. Always right? after oh. you buy an RV, but when okay. you buy it, we give you toilet paper. Where do you keep this toilet paper? It's hidden. It's a secret <laughs> stash underground. Okay. Yeah. Underground. All right. Um, so, so this is a cassette's toilet. You were saying cassette but toilet. I think you said this is a bigger capacity. So the that? regular uh, Solus Pocket had a three-gallon mm -hmm. cassette toilet. This is five gallons. So okay. this is like pooping on a five-gallon bucket. Nice. <laughs> better. I like five gallons better than three. <laughs> so when you go hunting or camping, you take your five-gallon yeah. bucket with you. Yeah. You got a five-gallon bucket right. here. How do you figure out who has to go take that cassette toilet in? <laughs> Paper, rock, scissors, shoot. <laughs> no, I tell Lola, if I'm driving, you're taking the cassette. What's <laughs> like whoever cooks doesn't do the dishes. Oh, oh right? right? Yeah. Whoever, okay. you know. Yeah. Is that is that a rule? Maybe Let's not. move on no. from this before we get in trouble. I had no idea. <laughs> I, in my house, I would do it for my wife. I would not make oh, her okay. do it. Yeah. I'm cutting that part out. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So this is the access This is to where your, you would uh, store the uh, propane. Oh, okay. So like I said, if you use propane, you, you just swap that right out. If you don't use it, which a lot of people don't, you just, you know, oh, look, there's more storage under yeah, there. there's more. So this is one of the ones that you could just take off, right? So yes. That's even, so that's what, I'm, that's what I mentioned yeah. earlier. Yeah. You just yeah. take it to a gas station and just swap it. Yeah, that's cool. But yes, you can add something extra. I'm not sure if batteries or whatever you want, you could do extra. You could. Well, this comes yeah. with lithium. So this has the EcoFlow okay. lithium package oh. from Winnebago. So this oh. has 5,000 watt hours of lithium batteries. To put that in perspective, a Travato has 9,000 watt hours. Oh, okay. So it's a little more than half of what a KL Travato has. Would have. Or so GL. where are those? Are those under the van yep. or inside the They're van? They're here somewhere. They're in there, yeah. Let's see. Remember, I'll, this I'll is give our everyone first, a little quick this look. This is our first variation of this. <laughs> yeah, let's take a look under here. Actually, I don't see anything down here. So it must be inside the van. They must be. But some nice... Uh, they might be under the toilet tank. Yeah. But I, I'm just giving everyone a little look under the van just in case you want to know you want so, to see so what's yeah. nice here is this is where all of your your tank water hookups are in the van okay so that really helps with winterization it helps with with stopping things from freezing so mm -hmm. you got your drain pump water pump this is your outside or inside mm -hmm. shower this is where you fill your fresh water tank and then you use it normal or tank fill here so you can move everything yeah. around That's there's cool. also a screen uh, oh check this thing out Little it's bag. Neat, right? Winnebago it's, always has some cool bags and stuff. It's a little hard to see. Can you see that? Yeah, it's like, so it's a, like a Molly bag. Gear yeah. Molly Hold bag. On, let's, see, let's see if we can get back there. There we go. There you can get a look go. at it. So. And then you got a whole screen for back here. I'm if you sure do I just ripped that off. You though. just ripped it <laughs> off. The ledge. Look but that's that. cool. So if you don't want that, you can just rip it off like that. No, that's true. Yeah, I did that um, deliberately. What else is cool uh -huh. is. So these are the shades. Yep. We always talk about the idea of having to store shades and get them out and do things. Yeah. This is great. Yeah, We're I already wish there. More, uh, more vans came with this, like with the setup like this. And I always talk about this. I yep. think this is ingenious. Yep. If you do have the doors open in mm -hmm. this in this 17 foot RV and you want to have some type of annex or like an outdoor, yeah. like a real big, outdoor shower. Big shower. Big shower. You just yep. do this, put that there, and yep. now 
there's a there is a curtain here that mm -hmm. drapes down, mm -hmm. and now you can actually take a real shower out Just here. Just do it right out here. Yeah. Yeah. If you're in the beach, if you went out on the beach or something like that. Let's say do it like the like the animals <laughs> do it. So and but this is front wheel drive, right? Being a pro master. So all pro masters. Yeah. Are front wheel drive. Front wheel drive. So. Come on, Hanky. Uh, you could you could probably take this on a beach. I don't okay. Know. Listen. You better take it easy. <laughs> well, I can't say Hanky. <laughs> no. <laughs> Okay, um, yeah, so that's, that's, Pretty neat, uh, right? yeah. So check that cool. out. Looks so the like new ProMaster has a ton of cameras. Yep. So you got one face in the back, you got one coming down. So this is, a, that's what helps give you that, that, uh, 360 view. Yep, we'll um, take a look at that when we go inside. Towing package, my guess yeah. is about 2,000, 2,500 pounds Two, okay. of towing capacity, which is, All right. which, which could be a small car, a Jeep, if you yeah. want. But, yep. you know, 17 feet, you don't need to tow anything. Yeah, take some bicycles or e-bikes yep. with you. Yep. you That's you what I say. Put a box on it and, yeah. and put some stuff on there. You can mount stuff to the back door. So you can mount like oh, okay, some Rover right. gear. Yep. You can mount like an Al van box, something mm -hmm. to the back door there. Are you guys carrying Rover gear? We are carrying oh. Rover gear. Yeah, I met with the owner. And very Super nice. Super nice Polish guy. Yeah. They make everything in Poland and okay. they bring it over. Yeah, really I have never end. met him, but I've heard of him and I've seen the gear. So really cool high-end stuff. stuff. Really. Yeah. Really Did we nice. talk about these rims also? Yeah. The, yeah. So they're black okay. factory That's nice. wheels. Aren't they yeah. nice? Yeah. I don't know why the lug nuts are gray. Yeah. No, Once look. again, you can use that uh, dip your paint. car or spray paint or dip your car. What does that even mean? It's like a it's a spray paint, but it's vinyl. So when you put it on, you can peel it off. Huh. See, so it's not permanent. Oh, you don't. Look at this, you can't dummy. mess anything up for people. Oh, I can always find a way to mess something up. <laughs> yeah, well, I guess that's true. The W. <laughs> yeah, I see that. Hey, you want to hear a funny story? What? So the other day, a customer comes in with a dog, mm -hmm. and and I noticed Shelly is showing them a Winnebago product, mm -hmm. and they walk up to the Winnebago, they take uh -huh. their dog leash, and they wrap it right, right here, there. yeah, and they continue to look at the dog, yeah, or to, to look at the RV, and I'm like. Yeah. Whoa, how'd you know to do that? Because I watch yours and Hank's videos and you talk about it. So I figured I'd walk up to it and I would do and, it. And test it out. And test nice. it out. I'm nice. like, how cool is that? It so, works. There's two of them. So yeah, that's most, cool. Yeah. So if you have two dogs, you can put both dog leashes there. Yeah, or a dog, a kid, a husband. A kid. Yes. Yeah, whoever you... Does your wife walk you on Disney on a leash? Whoever you need to keep in their Does position. Does she walk you on Disney on a leash? <laughs> um, yeah, right. we, don't, we don't do Disney. Don't but do okay. Disney. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. very cool. Uh, nice big sliding door. You right. can notice the it has a screen. So this screen here is always there. Okay. Um, kind of like a like a you know like a backdrop here. Mm -hmm. This is a screen that goes up and down as you want. And then when it's open, it kind of serves as a door. You can go oh, in and okay. out like that. Yeah. Um, this is neat. So I really like this a lot. Mm -hmm. So this, because it is 17 feet, they want to mm -hmm. give you outside areas. So yeah. they give you in the back that rear annex or like that real shower room, which mm -hmm. is really nice. And then here they give you kind of like an outdoor kitchen. Yeah. You know, so you, you have the outdoor kitchen. Food. You can move it here. You can move it up and down. Make it have, level. Make it level however mm -hmm. you want. You can also store other things here. So if you wanted a second one, if you wanted to put something else, they give you this whole thing here mm -hmm. to do that. But I really like, like a little L-Track setup. Yes, that's yeah. the order. So I really like having this extra thing here. It is nice. If I'm outside, sit by the fire, I got my dog chain on that mm -hmm. side. I got my, my drink here, my Bluetooth speaker. Yep. You got, you know, a lot of cool stuff. You have the screen closed, yeah. so that way bugs don't get in. Yeah. And it's a perfect setup. You got an LED light there. Yeah, I noticed that. But also I noticed, so these pockets don't come with the awnings, right? They, they do not. They come with solar. You see some solar up there? Yeah, I do. It comes with solar. Yeah. It comes with an air conditioner. It okay. does not come with an awning. Yeah. No. Okay. Awning would be hard because yeah, it's just the so size small. of it and all that. Yeah, it would be kind of But anything is possible. Yeah, anything is possible. We have had people want awnings on these, or um, some kind of bat wing. Have you seen the bat wings? I like, have. The echoes have the bat. <laughs> wing. Yeah, the echo has the bat wing. The new Sprinter really cool. Echo we did that video on that has yeah, a bat that's wing. That's cool. Yeah, I can't wait to see more details on that. Yeah, it's yeah. gonna be cool. Yeah, it's gonna be really, I think so. really cool. So um, okay, you so jump in? Uh, yeah. So you said you were saying there's solar panels. I'll nope. try to stand up here real quick and give everyone like a view of the solar panels there, is there you go solar 190 panels here. watt solar panel yeah that's the roof so you can see it 190 look, watt look solar you've got crib notes huh you've got crib notes crib notes <laughs> yeah <laughs> crib notes here I'll, can i show the people the notes you can i'm a i'll send you this pdf you can just, you can just put the pdf up that's just too fancy 
Oh, you can't too, read this. It's just too yeah. Weird. I know. I know. You got to um, pause it and then and then uh, the PDF is yeah, better. Yeah. So and then make sure you buy a T-shirt yeah, from twenty dollars from Vanasaur. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> um, so both these seats do swivel. Yeah. And what's nice is it has the new ProMaster chassis. So this okay. does have the nine-speed transmission. It has the push-button start. Can we turn some all, stuff on? We can if you like. It has yeah, all of the upgrades. Hold on. Watch your head. Flip this down a little. Okay. Yeah. So we have right, cool. the digital dash. We have the upgraded screen. We have the you know push button start. That, yeah, that charges your phone. Yeah. That so phone you don't charge the key in. Yep. Push button. Yep. You have the electronic parking brake here. You uh, got all nice. these new steering wheel controls. Nine speed yeah. transmission. You have the uh, the blind spot assist. Mm -hmm. The little triangles in the mirrors. Mm -hmm. um, this has some different camera views. Let's see. How do we? Show the camera. Probably views. you're gonna have to go. There, there you go. go. Nice big yeah. camera view there. Um, and then how do we get back to home? Apple CarPlay, Android CarPlay. Mm -hmm. Lots of cool things. There's gonna be some stuff that varies based on the chassis a little bit, yeah. right? That's what you guys are seeing. But you're gonna have a, a reverse camera for sure. USC, USB, possibly some 12 volt power there. Mm -hmm. So lots of cool things digital rear view mirror yeah that's always nice oh look there's another w there they they stuck that, that in there that's that so convenient it's a winnebago view behind us <laughs> very nice people love these winnebago views yeah. um so yeah so very neat lots yeah, of I think cool, it's cool lots of cool safety I like the features new chassis. as well i like yeah. the, the new chassis the new very chassis nice. is 280 horsepower 3.6 liter v6 gas engine uh -huh. with a nine speed transmission four wheel abs brakes trailer hitch Okay, you can read. That's awesome. I have crib notes. <laughs> don't know Just, what a, a you're going to forget that from five seconds. I don't from know now, what a crib okay, note fine. is, but I have them. You know, you never use crib notes in like when you were in high school, you know, instead uh, of reading yeah. the play. Cliff notes, maybe? Oh, cliff notes. Is that what is that what they called it? Yes. Oh, okay. Okay, I thought it was crib notes. Oh, cliff notes. Someone knows what I'm talking about Nobody out there. Knows. I thought that was some like hood saying that. Crib notes. From the crib. <laughs> My notes from the crib. Right, that's what I okay. thought you meant. Like, what is this guy talking okay, about? Okay, I swear that's what it is, but we'll see. We'll see. So, I, the uh, comments will let us know, I promise. <laughs> Lots of storage back here. There is a, uh, uh, is this a Max fan? I'm that's not sure. That's a Max fan. There's, there's a fan an AC. in the bathroom, yeah. and there's an air conditioner. Yeah. Very here's neat. The, here's the galley. It also has hot water. It has a propane stove that works on the propane that you're messing oh, okay, with back cool. there. All right, yeah. A nice sink, a nice big sink with hot water. Yeah, if you remove that, then I'm guessing you're going to have to put like an induction, oh, induction fridge. stove top here. I like the fridge. You can you access go. it from outside. So this swings all, all the, way the way out. Oh, out. Nice. So if you want to put a couple drinks in there, yeah. you just grab it. There you go. Open and shut it. Fridge yep. and freezer. Yep. Um, this this is, is very unique. Stuff here. This, oh, something else that's pretty cool. They don't have the magnet things anymore. So now they oh. have these nice heavy duty hinges. Okay, cool. Isn't that neat? Yeah. So they all have there the same go. hinges there. Where before they had magnets oh, that I'll would secure it to the ceiling. And is this a silverish? Yeah, it's like a matte gray, gray silver yeah. gray. Okay. And this is all like your water hose, your sewer hose, your power cord, all that. Yeah, it's here's here. your pizza oven up here with a pizza bunch of stuff. Pizza oven has some towing, st uh, not towing, oh, the spare heavy. tire, it has yeah, the window oh, shades. Yeah. All your stuff is in here, some yeah. like uh, armrest things. So check you know. these W's out. How cool is that? That's the back of the fridge. Oh this yeah, nice great. grill. Yeah, one there, one there, oh, one cool. there. Yeah, so it's got that grill has the same W's right there. And also back and there. And there's another the one over there. You got lots drawers. of drawers. This this would probably be a trash can drawer if I had to guess. Mm -hmm. Um now here's one. Mm -hmm. And then you got a miniature one. Right. So this is like Ma Papa, Mama, <laughs> Baby Bear. Everybody gets a drawer. Why am I seeing um, seatbelts? So that's part of the intrigue. You ready? Uh, yeah, because I'm so, seeing seatbelts over there. Yeah. What is that? What does so, that mean? Hold on. So this is where you fill me. This is where you fill your fresh tank. Oh. This is how you see how full it is. Oh, and so you bring your hose right into there. Bring it from the back. That. Put uh, it right there. Uh, and then uh, you do it. Oh. One ten plug. Okay. This is your eco hot. So when you go to preheat, mm -hmm. it it fills it up and then it heats up the the hot water so that way it's ready to oh, use right away. Cool. So you don't waste any hot water. Yeah. So cool. the the other pocket does not have hot water. 
yeah. a lot of this stuff it doesn't I'm noticing have. more seat belts behind you. Yes, so there's okay. lots of cool things going on right here. There. Okay. Yeah, so you need so, to... Right now, this yes. is one of the formations. So you have a little dinette. So you got yep. one here, you got one person can sit there, and yep. you have a two-person dinette. Yep. Are you, do you want to see the other? The magic. Are the you going to do, are you going to click? Should I snap my fingers? Go ahead, snap. Let's see ready? the awesomeness. Look at that. <laughs> now, you went from a dinette to a twin-size bed. Right. You don't so, give up an opportunity to show your legs. My what? legs? I'm, I'm sleeping. I'm six foot tall. Yeah, I got uh -huh. a little room on my feet. Got a little room on my yeah. head. This is here as a comfort. Now, this can, this can leave, and it'll just give you a little more width. Yeah. But, so this could be a twin size or like a big sofa. Yeah, look at it. Looks like, yeah. Yeah, it could be a sofa too. Yeah, you can, so, if you're having a party, having multiple a party. people can sit in here. See, look. See, look at that. I can sit over here. There's still room. We could put Lola. Pocket, we could put Mary right there. the last pocket we had, we had Lola uh -huh. and Mary in here. Yeah, that's cool though. Yeah, neat, right? Or you could just sleep. Like you're, if it's just one person, just one person you, you don't sleep. need to. Nope. You don't but, need a bigger but, bed. But what if there's more than one person? All right. And now, now have, I don't know if you guys can see this. Let me get out of it. We have a double bed. <laughs> Look at how much room right there. So we have a double bed. Why are you yep. showing my legs? You know. Gosh. Someone's so, got to show off all the. I don't know why you keep getting cuts on your legs. I had a propane tank in my trunk and I <laughs> oh, opened it and it came flying. No. I mean, that hurt so bad. My neighbors <laughs> heard me yell. Like, ah! Oh boy. You know what? You know what? You know what really hurts me about that? What? I wasn't there to get video. <laughs> My wife tried to see it on the ring camera. <laughs> oh, the car was blocking it. <laughs> um, okay. So and, and that's not you know. I, I hope you're all right. <laughs> so, so this is this is big. Look at it's this. it's not really complicated, but we're cutting it out of here. I think you guys will walk anyone through. Oh, 100%. and we'll do more detailed stuff but in the future. Bed. But yeah, that is massive. Look so, at that. But so there again, seventeen yeah. foot RV. I'm just trying to come out here just to show people. Open, Look at that. Up, open the passenger door. Yeah. Let me uh hold on. Here we go. Just look at how big that is so right lots there. Lots of space. That is. So you got very bed good. Here, very good. Bed here when you get out of bed. Mm -hmm. I mean, you got to scoot a little. Yeah. But lots of room. I mean, go fill. There it is out. still room for you to come down, come out. Yeah. This is if you got two does people. This even come up. Like, what does this do? Oh, that okay. looks like. Yeah. That's another. This looks like it does a lot of different combinations. I don't so, even know if we could do all the combinations. I don't know if we can either. But there yeah. is another one. You ready there to see is. It? Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. And so, now, <laughs> yes, in a seventeen foot RV. <laughs> uh huh. You have seating. For the table four, got bigger. Table doubled, so we went right. From, and you from here, sit two people over there, here. and then you could sit multiple people here. Sit two people there. Yeah, sit. and this could be up or down. It looks like. Yeah. Yeah. Sit two people there, but check this out. I got a seatbelt. Oh. Here, and it goes right. So when you were saying in the beginning you can uh, seatbelt four people in this. Yeah. So here. It's real. Then watch this. So this seatbelt okay. comes through and it, it goes over. And it latches right over there. Huh. Yeah, and this it, is interesting. And there's a lap belt also. Yeah, so this has a bunch of combinations built. That's actually really cool, man. How cool I is don't this? know exactly how obviously it's gonna come down to people and how they want to do it, but I mean, yeah, and can, I don't know if we're making the best representation. <laughs> I mean, we're not doing a but bad it job. It shows you though that yeah, that unfolds. This could fold out. You could do probably like a whole bunch of different combos of this. I right? mean, if you're driving with four people, so you have a driver and a passenger. Yeah. Obviously, that seat be facing four. Yeah. You can have two more people sitting right here with seat belts mm -hmm. and a table in front of them driving down the road. Yeah. Yeah, that's cool. And then that is just extra. So when yeah. those two people come in. They can sit right there. Let me show you. I'll sit yeah. right and I'm guessing someone could sleep this direction if they so want to. Now, so you can sleep in this direction. Yeah. Imagine so if this door here. was closed. This isn't bad, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Then I'm a little tall to sleep here, but you could probably stretch out. I'm a little tall. Try to have a sleep like this. Yeah. On but Sunday you can kind of lounge. On Sunday afternoons when I watch football, yeah. this is how I sleep. Right. So if you are if you have the door open and you're looking out here, you could... Yeah, this is comfortable relax. for me. I'm going to tell you. <laughs> it's actually interesting, man. There's nothing wrong it, with it. This. We could probably go through a bunch of different combinations you know, and, you and ask use, who, use cases for Who this. buys this, this type of van? And with all these different scenarios, I don't know if you limit it, to be honest. I mean, yeah. it's just you have two kids. You right. got a husband and a wife. You got just one person. Yeah. They can just leave this like this, and then just they can just get up and just walk around. Yeah. But they don't even need to like mess with this. But if you want, so like 
so you got two there. And we'll show them real quick, Hank, if mm -hmm. you don't mind. Yeah. So we just move this, unstrap it there, slide this whole thing over, mm -hmm. and now we're back. And then there's caps for those ends. There's caps. Yeah. There's something there. There's so that shuts in there. This goes here. Those go on. Okay. That goes there. Yeah. And now we're good. Interesting. Now, and that, so now you have this area here. Yeah. And then that's you, back as a single seat. So this is a seat, and obviously this here yeah. goes as the edge here. Yeah. But and then all of this can be cleaned up also. Very interesting. So I think you need to snap, and we'll clean it up and get back to what we're up to. All right. So now we've got it back more to civilization. I'm a little out of breath, but we're good. <laughs> good so, workout, good workout. But what's cool is there's a little extension here. I don't yeah. know, am I brave enough to sit on this? Yeah. I, I, I say for? you should do it. Is the weight limit 230 pounds? <laughs> <I don't know. laughs> sit gently. There you go. It looks like it. Okay. Yeah, it looks My like feet it's old. are up in the air. Yeah, it looks like it's holding your weight. <laughs> weight limit's 230 pounds. <laughs> okay. So how does this close? So you just press the buttons right here. Okay. It just drops in. Yeah. There you go. So then, this isn't even bad to sit like this. Yeah. Yeah, it's not bad. If you're sitting there and you wanted to kick your feet up, you could. You could double the table again right here if you want. This is cool, man. You know, if you need That's a bigger cool. workspace, let's say you work from the road. A mm -hmm. lot of people do that, right? They work yeah. remote, they travel. Let's say you need a bigger workspace, you're working, you can be facing outside. Yeah, if you have a bunch of stuff, then, like you see me do my podcast with a bunch when you're of done, equipment. You just close it. Yeah. You can come back here, you can make some food, use the bathroom, sit back down, you can work. You yeah, can you know what? I can't deny the cool factor of this really and uh yeah you got lights you yep. got plugs everywhere i mean i got i got 110 here i got usb right here so when i'm working this is a good avenue yeah. to charge things up um, so and just like you were showing if you let's say you have this closed if you're traveling you can use that seat belt over there seat belt, you, you put one there's not a seat belt there for this but side you can easily obviously sit right here yeah. there's three people yeah this is cool man yeah honestly i uh the fact that this is short, and then obviously, you know, people feet. will want to know price, which I suggest you guys go to Sunshine so State MSRP RV. So, MSRP is 158 mm -hmm. so, you know, there's that. This has the optional lithium package. Mm -hmm. um, you, you know, guys so will run down this if you want there to. Are, yeah. There is a screen here, so it does have the Truma system here. So, you got your Truma hot water, Truma cool. heater. Um, it does have, like, tank sensors, your battery, you know, all that. Mm -hmm. This is the screen here for the lithium system. Oh, cool. Um, so it tells you how much you use mm -hmm. and how long and all that. But like I said, yeah. 5,000 kilowatt or 5,000 hours, uh, watt hours. Mm -hmm. um, your Travato KL has 9,000. So yeah. just to kind of put it in, in perspective. And it'll charge up while you're driving. Charge up while you're driving. Charge is, up by solar. Is it a second inverter? Or charge, do you know? Second alternator? No. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, not all, uh, inverter. It does have an inverter. It does. has solar. It'll charge yeah. up when you're plugged in. So okay. lots of cool things mm -hmm. that you can do. Um, yeah. I, I got to tell you. It's not when, bad. When I got the 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 release that this was coming out a few months ago, I was really yeah. impressed. Then we're in Elkhart. We're in Indiana. Mm -hmm. And we see it. And I'm like, dude, this is going to be awesome. A 17-foot yeah. van with all of these features in it is insane. It is insane. very cool. I see why you like it. You want to go outside? Just I just want to show people again. We'll just walk out here. Yeah. Just so you guys can get a look here. And even, I think, let's let the camera adjust here right and uh close this up i just want to show people how we don't have to walk so this is the back yeah. so we're flat here at the back you can walk into the frame nick so people can see look at how tiny this is when you look at nick in videos <laughs> the van always looks so big even though we know it's not big yeah. but look at that man you're in one frame <laughs> yeah. That's how tiny this 17 is. 17 foot. I yeah. mean, you know, yeah. SUVs are 18 foot. Yeah. Roots so, have pickup trucks are 18 feet. Yeah. This is actually really, really, really cool. If you're in the market for, like you're saying, for an SUV, yeah. but you're interested in Class B vans. This is this is a great, and, very and good it, option. Yeah. And, and price wise, it's right around what, yeah. what the high end SUVs are. Yeah. You know, so. How, um, how many of these did you get in? That's what I'm curious. So we got two in yesterday. We're getting a few more. They do have okay. other colors. Mm -hmm. But it is real limited availability right now. Okay. Um, so, you know, I'm sure as time goes on, they'll make more of them. Mm -hmm. But, you know, 
I it's you know I mean we have 24 foot RVs and 22 mm -hmm. foot RVs. Yeah. Nobody else is building Lots on this 17 options. foot chassis. Yeah. I mean Road Check makes a Zion SRT, mm -hmm. um, and that's and that's a 19 foot. Mm -hmm. um, Coachman makes the Nova. That's that's 20 feet. This is 17 feet. So yeah. Really cool. And especially, I would say, especially with this new front. So I know folks are always asking me, like, when are we going to see more Euro style? Mm -hmm. So one, I would say, definitely the outside of this is, yeah. especially with the uh, Fiat, what is it, Ducata, I think. Yeah. Look here Slanted. on the outside. Yeah. But, you know, I think with the modularity in this, you're getting really, really close to that, right? Yeah. yeah. In terms of if you're looking for something, yes, I know, it's not full Euro style if you don't it's have, not. like, Crazy curves and Road all that kind of stuff. People are looking for pretty Euro style that play yeah, we did a video yeah, on the other yeah. day. But this, to me, I could see this on the streets of Italy, right. you know, in England and stuff like that. Just because of the size and yeah. all the things you could do with it, um, this is really, really, really cool in my opinion. So yeah, um, I agree. You know, I know I'm probably gushing about it, but like you said, it's just a really cool proposition. That's, there's no one else that's making a 17 foot ProMaster yeah. with lithium and a toilet and a sink and a shower yeah. and a stove and two sinks. What option? Are there any options that you can get with the pocket? The lithium. You can just do no the lithium. lithium or lithium. Okay, you can't get a pop top with this. That's just asking too much. That's just asking. Stop being greedy. That would just be insanely awesome. Okay, I'll let you get the last words in here. Yeah, uh, we will deliver this free anywhere in the mm -hmm. country. Uh, SunshineStateRVs.com is our website. We have our elite club, lots of cool stuff. Me and Hank always talk about. Yep. But yeah, we have a, we have a hundred Class B RVs in Gainesville, Florida, ready for you to pick any one that you would like. So hit up Hank, let us know. We'd love to help you out. Absolutely. We'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.